Welcome to this Morphic video. My name is Andrew Lemon from the Edge Software Consultancy and in today's video we're going to be showing you how to use the Structures for Morphic plugin for visualising and using chemical information within the Morphic spreadsheet environment. If we look at the Morphic interface and within the toolbox you can see there's now a chemistry section. Within the chemistry section there's a new plugin called the Structure plugin. The Structure plugin allows you to modify the behaviour of both cells and columns of a table to be able to view and calculate information from chemical structures. Let's start by adding a new table. We're going to call our table compounds because this is going to contain the information about a set of new compounds. I'm going to add three columns to this table. The first one's going to be called ID, which is going to be an internal identifier. The second identifier I'm going to use uh, to store the SMILES code for the structure. SMILES is a linear format for describing chemical information. The third identifier is going to be an external ID, which we'll get from the source information. So here's my table with three columns. First of all, let's add the numeric identifier, which we'll do using a formula. Now what I'm going to do is use the data import plugin in order to bring in my chemical information. So under the data menu I select the import data item. I'm then going to browse for a file which I've downloaded from the Zinc database. This file contains SMILES codes and also external identifiers from the Zinc database. So open my file, move along. In this case it's a space delimited file so we can see it's separated the two fields and I'm going to import the SMILES column first of all and then the external identifier. That will go ahead and import this into the current table. So we can see now we're going to have our three columns. We've got our first column with the identifier, we then have our SMILES column and then our external identifier. So. First of all, let's use the structure plugin in order to visualize these SMILES codes as chemical structures so we can recognize what structures they are. So to do that, I'm going to add a new column in here, which I'm going to call mole, which is going to contain the molecular graph of those structures. I'm then going to select the structures cell type from the, from the toolbox and then select the column heading. You'll see now that it's modified and added some extra properties within the properties panel. So I'm now going to add a formula which says to fetch the molecular structure from the SMILES column. And you'll notice immediately all the structures have been displayed in this column. So if I then up increase the size of the cells, you can then see a nice high quality rendering of all the structures in these SMILES codes. Okay, next thing I would like to do is to calculate the mass and formula based on these structures. So I'm going to add two more fields here. One's going to be called mass, the average molecular mass, the second one's going to be called formula. So first of all, let's calculate the formula. We do that by referencing the column that contains the structure type and then adding the mass value. If we scroll to the right here, you'll see that we've now calculated the molecular mass for all of these structures. In the second one, we also reference the mole column, and then it's called the structure formula. And that calculates the formula for all of those structures. So what we've shown here is how to import data from flat files into the Morphit environment, We've then transformed the chemical format structures, in this case stored as SMILES codes, but it also works from embedded mole files, and then to generate the molecular graph in a high quality rendering within the mole column, and then to use the structures column in order to calculate average molecular mass and the molecular formula. This completes this short video showing you how to use the structures for Morphit plugin. 
If you'd like more information about the structures for Morphit plugin or Morphit itself, please visit our website at www.edge-ka.com. Thank you for your time.